so after the lockdown uh, we have noticed that there is a lot of change in the way the learning and development industry has uh, moved forward it's amazing uh, that uh, what lockdown uh, did to many of us in terms of the positives of course we have already seen uh, the negatives of it but uh, i would also like to highlight the positives uh, personally for me making those videos you know many of you have watched those videos uh they still on youtube during the lockdown uh sitting there having the time to do research to learn new ideas uh to go through uh, various uh, you know modules uh, on the net that is available and then uh making those videos have been uh, like a game changer uh, for me uh, because uh, that's where i realized that uh, there is so much to learn and uh, even the best thing about making videos is that you can watch those videos uh, yourself and uh, you can also note down the areas of improvement and uh, as we know that there is no end to how much we can improve and what levels we can go now talking about the industry how it has changed that uh, i already talked about the hybrid lifestyle uh and the work processes that uh, we have been witnessing uh, the last uh, one and a half years now and uh, what that does is uh, it does give a person an opportunity to go to the classroom do those classroom trainings like what we used to do before that really bonds uh, people together that really peps up everybody including the trainer and uh, also the outbound programs that has taken off because that is something else you know that is uh, you know a relief a stress buster a uh, lots of learning and uh, a total fun memorable time i think that has taken off people have realized that that's a very good uh, way to drive uh, energy and uh, team building into the organizations and the online virtual sessions continue what it does is it gives an opportunity for virtual meetings we can meet more often we can attend uh, a lot of ttt programs from other trainers other organizations and we can uh, get fresh inputs ideas and learn new things and uh, when you're meeting people that often because uh, physically meeting in the cacophony of the cities and uh, the distances it's uh, hardly a possibility anymore so online uh, meetings virtual meetings with other trainers with other dignitaries and uh, learned people that's really uh, helps out a lot now uh, how the process has changed is uh, even on virtual as well as the classroom and the outbound programs it has uh, been a great change because people want engagement that is the time you know that uh, people want and look forward to engaging ways of uh, trainings and learnings and uh, just like uh, how the employees or the participants give you feedback even the trainers feel that uh, what uh, how much uh, i have uh, really enjoyed so uh, it's a when it is a two way process it always helps and uh, you know making things as simple as possible doing things in the regional languages as well i think that, that is a big change i can see a shift so uh, that's great uh, and uh, you know whatever the languages are whether it is the regional languages in my case it's bengali if it is uh, pan india it's hindi so as well some of us we are good at that as well and english of course it it just bonds us together so every language every culture and working throughout the country and engaging with international audiences uh, it's a great possibility i definitely see things now progressing in this stabilized way and uh, i see that uh, this new mode of uh, learning continues and uh, more innovations more uh, out of the box activities thinking and uh, engaging people and and the best thing that one can do is the bondings you know the relationships that uh, one builds with each other and i think uh, that for me is uh, what i'm looking forward to and uh, of course having a lot of fun a lot of memories to take back 
uh, lots of good people that we meet and uh, have those bonds and relationships that drive our futures. So that is how we I am looking at it. And of course, the collaborating part with others, uh, the learnability of the trainer himself or herself, and uh, you know the way we can accommodate uh, a lot of different types of work and uh, integrate them in this hybrid process, I think uh, is going to be and is always the key going forward. Thanks a lot for watching this video. Have a great day.